Mr. President, thank you for your indulgence. Senator Golden, thank you for putting forth this resolution. I think it's incredibly important. I, for one, am very proud to be standing here today uh, to sp uh, pay special tribute to the men and women in blue. As many of you know, I had the distinct pleasure of serving as a member of law enforcement before I was elected. And I can tell you firsthand that our law enforcement officials care very deeply for our community. Uh, they work long hours to keep us safe. They work tirelessly to stop the drug epidemic that is plaguing so many communities throughout this great state. And they're the first to put themselves into danger, whether it's responding to a domestic violence call or a traffic stop. And unfortunately today, uh, protecting the community from crime and danger, of course, is on the forefront of their mind. But in recent years, the scope of their job has expanded to other disciplines. They now are, have to be mental health professionals. They have to be addiction specialists. Uh, but it doesn't matter, because whenever they're called, they answer 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And sometimes I think that society forgets, and I think it's incredibly incumbent upon us that we remind society at large that behind the uniform, law enforcement officers are just men and women who want to work hard. There are men and women who want to keep our community safe, and there are men and women who want to make it home at the end of the day to their families. And at a time when their jobs are becoming more dangerous and unpredictable, they certainly need our support. And I firmly believe that regardless of our politics and regardless of what side of the aisle we sit on, everybody in this house agrees with us uh, today that we should be looking out for members of our law enforcement. I can't help but think of the codes meeting yesterday where Senator Bailey and I were discussing a piece of legislation. And we happened to disagree on that particular piece of legislation, but at the end of the day, what we did agree upon was that the members of law enforcement uh, were pillars in our community and we needed to do everything we possibly could uh, to support them. So that is a good feeling to know that regardless of our politics and regardless of the side of the aisle we sit on, we all believe that those members of law enforcement deserve uh, our support. So I, for one, of course, am happy to support this particular resolution. I am proud to have been afforded an opportunity to share in that brother brotherhood. I will forever bleed blue, and so long as I am in this house, I will always support the members of law enforcement. Thank you, Mr. President.